Kurum Jari, Manipur. Welcome. Yes. And good evening to our distinguished dignitaries present here, members of the press, and my colleagues. I am Natasha Grover, Running Operations Head Miss India Organization. I take this opportunity to extend a warm welcome to all of you. We are gathered here today to mark the occasion of the ceremony signing of the partnership agreement entered between the government of Manipur and the Times of India to host the grand finale of Terminal Miss India 2023. We should give it up for that as well. Thank you. I would like to now take this opportunity to introduce our esteemed dignitaries on this momentous occasion. Can I request Mr. Rohit Bhatt, Chief Business Officer of the Media Solutions Times Group, to present a token of appreciation to our esteemed dignitaries present here. Thank you. Thank you, sir. A token to Mr. Vinny Chen, Managing Director, Times of Thank you, sir. and Mr. Vineet Chen, Managing Director, Times of India, to exchange the agreement of offices. It is indeed an honor to be here in the land of Manipur. Manipur. On behalf of Times Group, I would like to thank the state of Manipur and the Honorable Chief Minister, Shri Vineet Singh, for this historic partnership of hosting a prestigious Miss India 2023 finale in the capital, in Fa. Uh, it is indeed my pleasure to be here today and it is a proud moment of the state and for me. I am glad to be a part of this agreement signing between the Department of Tourism, Government of Manipur and the Miss India Organization for hosting the grand final of the 15th edition of Miss India 2023 in Manipur in April 2023. The main purpose of this partnership is to celebrate the diverse and the inclusive Indian culture, as Vinit has mentioned. We want to inspire and empower local youth by welcoming the best of India's talent to Manipur. We also want to showcase the discussion and ideas of Manipur of which we are proud. This is the first time that this prestigious competition is being held in the Nordics. It reflects the growing interest in the Nordics, especially Manipur by investor. It shows the growing confidence in the state, regarding the security scenario and the opportunities of investment. The number of tourists coming in to the state has increased. After the COVID-19 pandemic, this service member saw an exceptional increase, exponential increase before the pandemic. I am confident that this service footfall will be going to the pre-pandemic level very short. With the upcoming Manipur Sanai Festival to be held from 21st to 30th November 2022, I am hopeful that we will be back on track as we reopen tourism business across the state. Our state is gifted by Yasu and the state has a very risk concerning heritage. You, you will all be surprised by its diversity if you take time to travel to different parts of our beautiful state. Every district is adult with natural beauty and has their unique attraction. Our honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi G has been urging people of the country to visit the Northern states and we have also been trying to attract so many domestic travelers as we can in the last few years. Our state is home to our 34 recognized tribes and we offer the most interesting customs, traditions, which are reflected in our varied cultural practices. Clothing, cuisine, 
and interest in crafts, Manipur's pride in the glory is also its robust sporting tradition. Our state hails it for all law for the sport of polo. Today, our youth are passionate about many others of our sports, which is evident from the lawyers that our state has brought from various prestigious sporting events for the nation. The senior duty of our district like Senapati, Tamilam, Sandals, and Social Group lives every visitor to our state step on. Destinations like Zuko Heli, Bali Meadows, and the Basiro Heli attracts many natural diving tourists from all over the world. Besides our tourist attractions like the Lakhla Lake, the Pebble Dunga National Park, and the Sunlight Gear at Vishnupu are attractions which are nowhere to be found in other part of the world. Through the Family Members India 2023 event, I believe that we will get our promotions for the 200 level by introducing our state's very tourism attractions and a product and by bringing business from different parts of India and the world to our state. I am thankful to the organizers of this event for considering Manipur Airport. The whole state is the divinity editions of the present. I hope the event will be a new chapter for producing business in the state and as it will highlight our attraction to the world at large. Thank you. Thank you.